Okay, I'm back. Um, now I'm going to take my liner brush and I'm going to come into my red and I'm going to make a fine outline along the edges of my white. Now, while I did go away from camera, I did come in with my liner and sharpen up my points on my white fringe only because I need them to be perfectly straight. What we're doing is we're outlining the red on the perimeter of the white. Sorry if I'm not talking while I'm doing this. It's just that I'm trying to create some pretty straight lines here. And while talking, I will jiggle. Now basically what I'm trying to create here is like an EKG, a... Uh, um, from a heart monitor on a strip of the white paper that they have. I am leaning my hand on the table to get balance and keep from jiggling. So both hands are actually on the table. If your lines come out a little crooked, it's okay because you can always come back in and clean them up with the paint. Okay, that's all done. Cleaning my brush. Now my next step is going to be with my fuchsia pink. I'm going to create a heart on one of my nails. I'm going to dab the brush a little bit in the paint. And I think I uh, will do it here. Make a nice little heart. Remember, a heart is very simple. It's just a teardrop. You are going over your French. Now I'm going to take my liner brush and I'm going to perfect my outer lines. These designs that I'm creating, I'm using the acrylic water based paints, but in your case, you can use whatever color medium you have to create your designs, be it nail polish, like I'm using water-based acrylics, watercolors, whatever you have. You can even, instead of using acrylics for this um, heart like I'm doing right here, 
you can actually come in and do it with um, sparkles, glitter. You would base coat the heart with, um, you could use gel, you could use simple clear polish and sprinkle it with some pretty glitter. And here's your basic little nail design. These you can create on all the other, every other finger or just use this one on like a ring finger. Um, just make a nice set. On um, this one, if you want, you can come back with the a black or different purple or different color outline the edges if you like. Put a uh, X and an O in here if you want initials of someone else or you can come back in here and also put in a lighter pink heart in the middle. There's a lot of varieties you can do with this design so I hope this basic design has inspired you and you create something with this pattern. Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed my videos, please subscribe to my channel, rate, vote, leave questions and comments, and you can also visit my fan page, which is Nail Expressions on Facebook. Thank you.